but it's what I need. This is what I want. This is what I desire. I'm giving you what you need, you want, and desire. Is that not give and take is my question. It's still give and take. Okay. I, I just want to make sure. I think that is give and take. So I just want to make sure we're on the same but, page of that. But because I'm giving I'm you looking, something that you require of me, whether it's yeah, and I'm, I'm telling you, I require you to spend your money on me. That's what I require. <laughs> because if you're not, you then, right? That's yeah. What, what, what are we doing here? So you, so you saying there's no women that will spend money on you? Huh? If that's what you require. You said what? Are you saying, because you're saying women don't see the way you do. I know too many women that throw money at they do it all the time. So No, I'm, I know. What I'm saying is, if, if you're not willing to spend your money on your man, then it's a problem. I agree with that. See, I, I agree with that because I, I, I spend money on my, pay, on my man. So... <laughs> But not all women, not all women, particularly these women, these women that he's talking about, which is a majority of the women, they don't want to spend a dime. They don't want, they don't, they don't want to throw a lick at a snake. But I also have a question though: is it, is it a problem or a thing between men to where you have a problem? Like how women do? You don't do enough for me. So is there a man that they know that feel like women don't do enough for them? Because I've come across a man like this that I, to me, give you everything, me money wise. But you come to me to tell me, uh, when you want to do this for me, do that for me. But damn, to me, I've given you my fucking everything. So therefore, is there any man out there that, that have an opinion? And you're not even a yoke. You're, you're, you're not able to give him what he's requiring, even though he's giving you what he thinks <laughs> required to give you. Um, he feels like you know, he doing what he, his standard is and what, it goes back to the evil yoke thing that we were talking about for you. You might not be that dude for me because we don't see things the same way as far as the way a relationship should be balanced and the way it should function. And if we don't see the same way on how a relationship should function and how raising a family and generational, all this good stuff, how that should be function, and I think it should be okay for us to say, hey, this is not working. Let us step back and find what we need in somebody else because we are not finding it with each other instead of staying each other in dysfunction. Because if, I, if I'm with a dude and he requires me to give him a chain, I don't know, it could be a chain, it could be, let, let's say he's into, okay, a lot of dudes like this, let's say he's in a video game. And if I don't feed his video game Okay, he may have a problem with that. He's spending money on me, but I'm not feeding his video game habits. Oh, bitch, he left money in his pockets. You're so close. He may, he may look at me like, yo, she ain't, she ain't doing that giving and take thing. I'm paying this and that, and she don't want to pay for my video games. I cannot be upset at this man because one homegirl probably was playing for this video game. She's probably keeping his gaming, uh, 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 the armory of his gaming and all that good stuff. Got the better headphones. She got all this extra stuff. Got the subscriptions out the yin yang. She taking care of all of that for this man. But one day she stopped or it starts to fade away or she started getting bored and her money starts going somewhere else. That has happened before. Same thing for men. Their money can start going to other women and money can start going to other places so something broke down something was not consistent and we as and we as adults need to realize that we so the turmoil and the trauma that we're going through we have to be accountable to how we <laughs> fed into that situation mm. So you cannot be, oh, it's they fault, they fault, they fault, when you done set a standard that you just wasn't, didn't have the discipline to keep up or just didn't want to because you were trying to get over for a while. 
That's true. Hey, which it is. You put on to stop somebody to try to get what you want. People could put on the facade for 20 years in a marriage and have 20, 30 years in a marriage. They've been putting on this whole facade and it won nothing to what they wanted at all. They're doing it because it's expected of them. They're doing it because their standard was set. That's why they, and it's required. That's why they do. And you can't split up. There's that too. Break up. Well, so there's a lot of factors. Go. Mo, what's good, bro? Want to jump in? You here, bro? What's up? Hello. Yeah. 